I'm an active tennis squash and squash 57 player and I get through a lot of grips. My default grip for a long time has been the Caracal PU grip. It's a firm favourite with a lot of the racket players. Recently I've been experimenting with grips, especially given the COVID-19 situation and the need to change grips more often. Today is World Squash Day, but I am looking at contoured grips, which applies to all racket sports. On the tennis court this summer, I've been using the X-Rip. This grip comes with an internal contour ridge, and it gives you a very nice feel, but it is not as contoured as I expected it to be. So, I have experimented to try and increase the contour, and you can see that I have succeeded with this racket. I got this result by ripping off the X-Rip grip, and the contour was left behind on the racket. Then I overlaid that with a PU grip, and the ridge was more pronounced than before. I'll try and show you this in a moment, as I'm going to re-grip this racket on my left with an X-Gel. I'm also going to re-grip this racket on my right with an x tra which has an external contour. So that is three ways to get a contour grip. An x tra with an external contour, an X-Rip with an internal contour, and then a combination of an X-Rip and a PU grip. It may be a bit hard to see, but there's this ridge, this white band here. And this is the ridge within the X-Rip, which I have on the centre racket. When you take off the X-Rip, you can leave the white band behind, and if you overlay that with the PU, then you get a more exaggerated ridge. I'm going to put the extra on the racket on my right and the X-Gel on the racket on my left. I now have the X-Gel on the racket on my left and it is extra cushioned grip which I'm guessing may be good for my tennis elbow which I unfortunately picked up by running into a wall of all things. It feels very nice. I'm now going to overlay this grip with an extra. These three rackets now have the three different Caracal grips on them. The X-Gel, the X-Rip and the X-Tra. The X-Gel is extra soft. The X-Rip has a contour ridge that's under the grip. And the X-Tra has the external ridge. It's personal preference as to which one you like the most. Personally, I've been using the X-Rip with the PU cover for the deeper ridge. My latest favourite is the X-Tra, and many people at my club have started using these. That said, the X-Gel feels nice, so looking forward to trying that for the first time later today.